Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to disassemble the Canon 15-85mm lens to get access to the image stabilization flex cable. Recently I had this lens with image stabilization problems. I had to disassemble the lens, replace the flex cable with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to disassemble the lens to get access to the flex cable. This video is part of video series about repairing the Canon 15-85mm to lens. In this first video I show you how to disassemble the lens. The next video is about replacing the flex cable with a new one, but actually this is the same as the Canon 18-200mm lens. And the last one is about assembling the lens. The links are in the description below. Before I will start let me talk about the tools that I will use to disassemble the lens. I will use a Philips 3.0 screwdriver, a Philips 2.0 screwdriver, a plastic spudger, a metal tweezers, a pliers and a wood screw. If you're interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. I hope this video will be useful, helpful, informative and adds value to you. If that's the case, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation or buy a camera or lens from my webshop. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. Also, there's an update section in the description. If I have anything to add to this video after it has been posted, then I add it there. So I would highly recommend to check it. So, let's get started. This is the lens which aperture flex cable will be replaced with the new cable next to it. Remove the two small screws from the electronic connector. Remove the four bigger screws from the bayonet. Lift up the bayonet a little bit on the other side of the electronic connector, then push out the inner cover ring. Be careful not to damage the flex cable, which is between the electronic connector and the PCB. Remove the flex cable of the switches, which are on the rear lens sleeve, then remove the sleeve. Disconnect the flex cables. Remove the manual focus ring. Remove the screw from the PCB. Remove the PCB. Remove the screws from the rear of the lens.
remove the rear cover. Remove the zoom rubber ring. Remove the plastic cover. It is not necessary to remove the cover and the zoom brush. You can skip this part to continue with removing the cover of the zoom pin and the pin itself. Remove the zoom pin. It is not necessary to remove those three screws, you can skip this part. Remove the screws from the USM motor. Remove the USM motor. Remove those six screws.
Use a wood screw to remove the plastic rings. Slide out the rear lens element. Separate the lens units. Remove the screws from the image stabilization unit. Remove the flex cable, then remove the image stabilization unit cover. Remove the cover ring. Remove the metal cover. The cover is held by strong magnets, so pliers should be used. Remove the small springs. The next step is to remove the broken flex cable and replace it with another one. I don't have a full video of it, but the process is the same as with the Canon 18-200mm lens, so you can follow that video, which link is in the description below. The only difference is that this image stabilization unit has two flex cables adhered together, so we have to separate them. Use a plastic spudger to unfold the end of the metal cable holder. Be careful, because a flathead screwdriver or metal spudger can damage it, so use a plastic one. The video of replacing the flux cable is in the description below. I hope this video was useful, helpful, informative and added value to you. If that's the case, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation or buy a camera or lens from my eBay webshop. 
The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So thank you very much for watching and see you next time in my other videos.